Welcome back to another new Two Minute Tuesdays. My name is Ramon Hernandez, the AT specialist, and today we might exceed two minutes. Today I want to go over the three categories of assistive technology. When being taught assistive technology, we are introduced to the three categories of AT, those being low tech, mid tech, and high tech. You can think of low tech as the opposite of high tech. Let's say a student has trouble writing on a flat surface, and they are not able to hold a regular pencil or pen. An AT specialist could offer a high-tech solution like dictation or speech-to-text, but the parents want the student to be able to write. Well, a low-tech option is a slant board, which is a board that is slanted diagonally to raise the paper or notepad. For the act of writing, they would test out different shaped pencil grips and maybe even a different shaped pencil holder. Pencil grips are plastic or rubber that wrap around a pencil so that your fingers do not slide on the wood. Pencil holders are similar but they go at the end of the pencil. A pencil holder's purpose is for a person to hold a pencil no matter how your hands or fingers are shaped. The reason this is low tech is because you don't have to charge it or add a battery or program it. The maintenance on low tech is low and sometimes it's inexpensive. Other examples of low tech are visual schedules, graphic organizers, highlighters, velcro, etc. Then we have mid tech. Mid tech can be technology that is electronic or non-electronic, but either way is low maintenance. Examples include screen magnifiers, audiobooks, scooters, adapted switches, calculators, I think you get the picture. High tech is a phrase you've probably heard of in a commercial or an ad. It refers to advanced technology or an electric device. Anything with a battery that needs to be charged, powered, or programmed is high-tech AT. Examples include computers and their software, tablets and iPads, smart boards, etc. There are a few ways to remember the differences. I was taught two methods. The first being low-tech is non-electronic and low-maintenance. Mid-tech is electronic but still low-maintenance and high-tech is electronic and high-maintenance. Another method is thinking of low-tech as a physical book, mid-tech as a Kindle, and high-tech as an iPad. So if you are a teacher, administrator, parent, guardian, or even if you yourself have disabilities, definitely take a look at all three categories. Also, look out for my webinar that I will be creating soon that goes deeper into the world of low-tech AT. I hope this information helps you with finding the perfect tool for you, your student, or your child. Thank you so much for watching and learning. I will see you in the next two minutes.